Last summer, I went to Kids Across America, or KA, camp with by the hand. Everything we did revolved around God. The sports we played, the words we spoke, even the meals we ate. With so much activity surrounding God, I was bound to meet him there. One night, we went to a clearing in the forest and watched an outdoor play about Jesus. That is where I finally bumped into him and looked him in the eye. While I watched the life of Jesus happening on the stage, I was amazed at how much he went through for me. I found out Jesus could save me from sin and give me eternal life with him because he died on the cross. At the end, the players asked, would you do the same for any of your people? I thought about it and decided, no, I would not. I was amazed at his sacrifice. The players told us to find our team leaders if we wanted to talk about the performance. I looked around and saw Miss Katie, an all-gale team leader. As I got up to talk to her, tears welled up in my eyes and escaped down my cheeks. Miss Katie rushed over to me and kept patting my shoulder and saying, it's going to be all right. I felt convicted over the sin in my life, and I was broken over how Jesus sacrificed him, his, himself to take it away. As we talked, Miss Katie said, was there anything about the drama that moved you to decide to follow Jesus? I whispered, yes, I want to follow him. I couldn't forget how he took my punishment way back then, before I was even born. His love made me want to accept him. Miss Katie put her hand on my head and she talked to God with me. We asked him to forgive me and thank him for his son. We invited him into my life. I didn't know squat about God and his amazing abilities until by the hand and KAA came into my life. With them running into God was inevitable. That night I told myself I would always live for God. The task isn't always as easy as I thought it would be. I will still I still struggle sometimes, but because I know God, I will continue to walk with him along his paths and know him by my whole life.